Hey in there. Uh, I thought in celebration of uh, me passing 100 subscribers and then falling back to 99 subscribers that I would actually make another freaking video after a whole month. Yeah, I have no excuses for my absence these past few weeks. I will place it upon myself that I just didn't commit fully enough to keeping the channel going during a time when I was very, very preoccupied with a lot of work I was doing for the band uh, when our new album came out and actually the, week, the weeks leading up to it coming out and then a whole list of things that I was working on that completely consumed my attention. Uh, however, I, I'm not offering this as an excuse because clearly if I really want to stay in gear, as the name of this channel indicates, I, I have to get better about not falling off the horse during times when I'm really, really busy. Because after all, I, a big part of feeling fulfilled in my career is being busy. It's not being idle and having a lot of free time. <laughs> that's, not what, that's not why I'm doing this for a living. It's not because I wanted more free time. It's a good thing to be busy. It's a good thing that the band has a new out record out and uh, I've been cherishing that fact, but that doesn't give me an excuse to, to stop going to the gym and stop updating this channel. The fact is not lost on me that there are people who, who've continued subscribing to the channel even during these weeks when I haven't been updating or posting anything at all. Presumably because they find some inspiration in the videos I've already posted and, and uh, I, that means something to me and I, I definitely appreciate that and I understand that because there are a lot of other YouTubers who, who post stuff that means something to me and it would bother me if they just suddenly disappeared. But I also understand that, that life is uh, unpredictable and sometimes things like this might happen but still at the same time I think we should give, our, give ourselves enough slack within reason but not stretch out that slack to the point where you just completely give up and walk away from everything, which is essentially what happened to me last year. And I never really felt, over these past few weeks, I never really felt like I was in danger of completely uh, reverting back to the state I was in before April when I started working out again and started logging my meals again. But uh, it could have happened. The longer I went without thinking about going to the gym, the longer I went without filling my exercise ring, uh, the more danger I was in. However, I did keep logging this whole time and I have continued losing weight. I'm actually now down to uh, 204.5, which is about five pounds down from where I was last time I posted a video. So that's great. And that, that, is, that is one thing that has kind of kept me going. So I hadn't really, it wasn't like I just lost all hope for this. I was just like, going, okay, Jim, I can't deal with this today. I don't want to think about it. But I should have made time for it. That's really not that big of a deal. <laughs> Part of the stress I was, I was putting myself under was the fact that I was learning a lot of new stuff. We've had an online store, but we've never really sold our own music before. This time we wanted to do it ourselves, so, which was a lot more complex than I imagined, but also not that, not that hard in the end. Now that I figured it out, it, it's, it's a lot less daunting, so. I, I think it's pretty typical of me, like when I'm, when I'm really focused on learning something new, I have a tendency to just kind of push everything out. It's like tunnel vision. But again, I do need to train myself to be better to not let go. <laughs> not completely let go of my routine when those things happen because it's going to happen again. I think going forward I just need to be a little bit more cognizant of when those dominoes start to tumble. I've got to try to catch it as soon as I can before it, it, it uh, becomes, you know, turns, you know, a week turns into a month, a month turns into two months, and then pretty soon I'm right back where I started, right? And then the weight starts coming back on and I don't want to let that happen again. That's the whole point of this channel is trying to learn how to prevent that from happening ever again. And it's actually happened on this channel, so so we can all learn from it. So anyway, I gotta get moving here. I'm not sure when I'm gonna be able to post another video. It probably won't be until next week, because uh, the band's about to hit the road tomorrow morning, actually. Anyway, thanks for sticking around. I'll see you again soon. Bye.